वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल इन टू डेज वीडियो आई क्रिएटेड दिस आई नो बहुत लोगों को लाइट मेकअप अच्छा लगता है लाइट आई लुक अच्छा लगता है सो फॉर दैम आई क्रिएटेड दिस लुक एंड आई रियली होप गाइज दैट यू विल इन्जॉय दिस मेकअप ट्यूटोरियल सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द ट्यूटोरियल आई वुड लाइक टू से दैट प्लीज टेक ए मोमेंट एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल एंड डोंट फो गेट टू हिट दी बेल आइकन सो दैट वेन एवर आई विल कम अप विथ न्यू कॉन्टेंट यू विल गेट द नोटिफिकेशन now without further ado let's get started so guys here i am with my bare skin i already applied a moisturizer and a serum to prep my skin for today i'm going to start with my eye makeup first and for that i am applying this tape to give it a very smooth cat eye finish for today i'm going to use this concealer la girl pro and my shade is pure beige at first i'm going to apply it on top of my eyelid area and then i'm going to uh, blend this concealer with my fingers because i was really unable to figure it out where is my concealer brush or beauty blender so yes guys here's a tip you don't need a beauty blender or a concealer brush to blend your concealer and to set my concealer i'm going to use this loose powder from fit me and i'm in the shade light medium and i'm taking this fluffy eyeshadow brush and uh, with the help of this brush i am going to apply it very lightly and then uh, dust off the excess one for my eyebrows today i'm going to use this one from etude house this one is really inexpensive so you can go for it at first i'm going to brush my eyebrows in the upward direction and then i'm going to draw a line after drawing a line i will slowly and gradually fill my brows and now i'm going to brush my eyebrows in the downward direction and the same way i'm going to draw a line and then i will fill up my brows and that's how guys i do my eyebrows with a pencil enhancer and it's a really great way for all the beginners if you are a beginner then i will say and suggest this way to fill your eyebrows and yes my brows are ready and let's move to the eyeshadow for eyeshadow i'm going to use this one from makeup revolution petrica bright and for my transition shade i'm going to use this one this one is queen and it's a very beautiful transition shade so for uh, today i'm taking this fluffy brush and i'm applying this transition shade on my crease line and look how beautiful my transition shade is looking so next shade is this one this one is uh, taste the rainbow and i'm going to apply this shade on my outer corner of my eyelid to create a depth after creating depth i'm going to blend the transition shade and this one that is the taste the rainbow so that there will be no harsh line And now I'm taking this beautiful shade called the birthday cake. It's a lavender shade. It does have a very fine glitter particles, but not the chunky ones. And it's one of my favorite shade from this palette. And after blending this out, I'm going to take this one from Wet n Wild, and uh, I'm going to use this powder black eyeshadow as my eyeliner. And for today, guys, I'm going to apply this. Uh, let's say i'm going to create this wing liner from the mid part of my eyelid area and i'm dragging it all right i'm done with my eyeshadow and i'm going to remove this tape and now look at it it does give me a very smooth and fine finish now let's move to the face for face i'm going to use today this primer from wet n wild it's a matte primer but uh, yeah i will say ki within 500 rupees this is a very budget friendly primer and it's perfect for beginners for today foundation i'm going to use this one from nika it's a skin shield foundation and don't worry guys i'm going to mention the shade in the description below as well as on the screen so yeah do check that out this is a very 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 nice foundation it does give me a very full coverage its one layer is like enough for your skin and also don't forget to use the foundation on your neck because it's really important guys ki aapka face aur aapke neck ka shade similar rahe so yes after blending the foundation 
very well let's move to the concealer so i'm going to apply the same concealer on my underneath eye area and uh, here also i'm going to apply the concealer where i can see a slight discoloration and then i'm going to blend it out using a tan beauty blender After blending the concealer, I am going to set it using the same Fit Me Loose powder using a beauty blender and then I am going to keep it for some time and yeah, by the meantime, I am going to bronze my face. For today, I am going to use this one from Sugar and yes, I am going to mention the shade. I really really love this product. It's really really blendable it's a very smooth product it gives a very fine finish so for today i'm going to bronze my uh, cheeks and then of course my forehead and also my jawline And now I'm going to dust off the loose powder using a makeup brush and after then that let's move to the blush for today I'm going to use this one from sugar it's a coral blush this shade is like really pigmented guys so do take it very little at a time and then gradually build it today i did not contour my nose so i'm going to apply this blush on my nose also uh, so that it will create a very refreshing look here i am done and let's move to the eye part here i am applying the transition shade in my lower waterline area and uh, you know why guys because i really don't like to apply kajal but here yeah, i'm going to apply this kajal from key beauty 24 hour kajal uh, in the shade spade in my upper waterline area so that uh, it will uh, really give a fine finish now let's move to the mascara for mascara i'm going to use this one from color bar it's a very very lovely mascara which comes uh, under 600 i guess and uh, yeah it is not waterproof but currently this one is my favorite why because it does have two different type of uh, mascara one is for voluminizing and the second one is lengthening so yeah this is a budget friendly a great product you can give it a try i highly recommend this one to all of you now let's move to the highlighter part for today i'm going to use this one from maybelline in the shade molten gold and i'm going to highlight my high points of my cheekbones then my chin my nose bridge uh, like bridge of my nose i guess and here yeah, my cupid uh, area of my lips then my inner corner of my eyes and not to forget my brow bones which is very important So for today I'm going to use this lipstick from Lakme Forever Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Pink Ballad. It's a very lovely nude shade from the Pink family and here yeah, if you like it you can purchase this one. Uh, it's uh, inexpensive and budget friendly. And after applying this lipstick I am going to set my makeup using a setting spray from the faces canada it's currently my favorite one it's a drugstore product and it's really really affordable so yeah uh, i'm already done with my makeup i finished it and let me change my clothes and uh, wear some accessories and i will be back soon 
and this is the final look guys i really hope that you enjoyed this makeup tutorial and if so then please don't forget to like this video share this video and also don't forget to subscribe my channel and also you can follow me in my instagram account link will be mentioned in the description below take care i love you guys bye Mwah. Thank you.